everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to the channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, and remember to share guys. And today guys, it's Manchester United 1 PSG 3. Paris has struck Manchester tonight. Manchester United unfortunately is struck love struck by Paris from Paris with love as they say in those movie theaters I cannot get that right but we have lost unfortunately we are still sitting top in our group as long as we can beat RB Leipzig then we've got nothing to worry about even get a draw we will be through to the next round of the Champions League despite that guys although we lost against PSG there could be some moments where we can be proud um, the fact that we did test PSG at times although we was quite annoying with the ball and I'm very sure you guys were annoyed when, when Manchester United had the ball. There were so many opportunities where you thought we could be a bit more um, precise, decisive, you know, as well. Even being clinical, guys, because unfortunately we wasn't clinical. We had good opportunities, but PSG took their opportunities when they, uh, the chances arise. Unfortunately for us, we didn't take ours. And the sad thing about that is that we was a man down. We play with 10 men. Fred, ugh, I'm very annoyed, guys. How annoying is that, that Fred, Fred, knowing that going into the second half is a, it's a, it's a chance, is a big chance, and Oli had the decision to take Fred off. He decided not to take Fred off, and it has to go to him as well. Although you can say, oh, the player's at fault as well, because he as well was stupid, Whoa. knowing that you're on a yellow card, launching at the player like that. The referee probably be annoying, probably being frustrated about you again. You know what? This time I'm giving you a yellow card. Off. Red card. Because, I don't know, Fred was lucky to be on at that particular moment of time. He shouldn't have been on. He was lucky. But unfortunately, he saw this colour. He definitely saw this colour. And he looked like he was going to cry. But in that game, guys, to concede so early in the first half, five minutes in with Neymar scoring, you must have thought, oh my God, it's going to be a long night. A long night. But... With that on goal, I thought it was an on goal. But the the panels, I don't know what they were smoking. Whatever they were smoking, weed, hashish, whatever, like skunk, mush, whatever they were smoking, I don't know how they gave it to Marcus Rashford. Because I didn't know I saw Marcus Rashford take a shot. It did take a big, big deflection off of Danilo. And Danilo again must have thought, bro, again, like you again, I'm I'm getting these deflections. And it's always you, my friend. But unfortunately. For him, Mark Rashford scored. But I still believe it was an on-goal. Going into the second half, you think that being 1-1, yes, bring on a midfielder because where in midfield is where we needed the guy. We needed help. But Oli never saw that. But PSG, PSG, kudos to PSG's manager because he saw the opportunity to bring on three players and then capitalised on, on the fact that we was just exposed them on the right hand side and that moment then we was exposed them on the right hand side we should have taken our chances but no with Cavani hitting the crossbar with that delightful it was a very very good attempt to finish and try and pull us into the lead but no we they hit the pop crossbar and then PSG took the lead eventually and then as soon as PSG took the lead with Marquinhos the red card came on the red card came out Fred was out Fred saw red Fred and Red saw Red and he was out, he was pissed off, he was crying and then from there I thought, well, we're going to get it, we are going to get it and then yes we did, we got pumped with Neymar making it in the 3-1 with the match with the match ending 3-1 Manchester United still top of their group table so it's still looking good for us Manchester United fan is still looking good for us right now we just have to just fit, hope that we can beat RB Lightship and not mess up my Man of the match, there's no man of the match, guys. Don't give the match. It's between Fred and Marshall because Marshall did annoy me at times. He had opportunities to put us f in front. He fell not to. As well with Fred, annoying me with that record. I'm going to have to give it to Fred, guys. Fred will be my don't give the match, guys. <sighs> Wasn't it today, guys. But despite that, guys, we just have to just look forward to the next game, hoping that if we draw or win, we will be through to the next round. And that's all we need, a draw. 
And Manchester United fans, there's nothing to be upset about. We we lost we lost against a good side against PSG because they ain't that great. They ain't that great, guys. There's nothing special about PSG. You know that yourself. Nothing special. We could have had them if we was clinical and took our chances. But today we did not take our chance and we got a man sent off, which was Fred. But well, apart from that, guys, I wouldn't be too upset. I would not be too upset, guys. Just chin up. Next game against West Ham, we go again. We go again. Remember, guys, remember to subscribe to the channel. And remember to smash that like button. Remember to share. Remember to share. And follow the official Red United TV Instagram account, which is Red United TV one Remember to follow my socials as well, guys. And, guys, remember to keep it united. And remember to keep it Red United. I'm out. Peace out.